Hi guys, Dave in Texas here again. Uh, okay, here we go again. Um, this is that same uh, Zoom R8 board. And for some reason, uh, no one wants to take your word for it anymore. You have to prove everything you say on YouTube. Because up pops someone that calls you a liar. Or says that you're exaggerating or some other bullshit. And it's like, it gets really old, you know? I mean... I've been doing this for a long time, and uh, looks like, you know, after a year of doing this, showing this stuff to you, and uh, telling you the God's truth each time, not bullshitting you, uh, you'd realize I'm telling you the truth, <laughs> all right? Now, I did a video on the future of guitar pedals, and I showed you a Zoom R8, uh, just that box only. And that had hundreds of different effects that you can do with it. And I'm telling you the truth. You go to it. You push effects. Up pops your board, right? There you see it clean. Right? You go down to it to the patch. And you dial in any kind of effect you want. That's the clean effect. Right? Here's the chorus. You can hear that chorus very readily, right? And they're kind of clean of effect, right? Here's a box crunch. So it's got different amplifiers. It's got like 12 different amplifiers that are built into this thing so it can sound like those specifically. You can choose those, then choose an effect to go through that particular amp, all right? Now, uh, one thing that really is upsetting is that uh, on this thing, uh, you know, you hear this, these effects. And say you don't like that, well, you, can, uh, you, you actually could, can edit those exact effects. Like I said before in the video, but I didn't show you. I must not take enough time to explain this to you. All right now. Compensator limiter. I'm okay, sorry, compressor limiter, right? Turn it on. There's your compressor. Okay. You can adjust it. See how it's adjusting from 0 to 2 to 3 to 4. You know, attack can be fast or slow or medium. Well, it's fast or slow. The tone is adjustable. The level's adjustable. On and on and on. Alrighty. Now, uh, you can go to FX on the same edit. Turn it on. Uh, phaser type, uh, ring modulation for that particular effect. You need a slow attack. All right, fix wah. The same big crunch. See what I'm saying? It does all this, and all you gotta do is just choose it. All through your edit button. That's all you have to do is you don't like that frequency, it's playing it too slow or too fast, well you change it. Simple, right? Uh, or say for example that uh, on your preamp you want a uh, big crunch, uh, you want an MS drive, <laughs> right? Cabinet matched. Uh, you want to go with a uh, combo, <laughs> combo head, uh, tweed. You want it from a, from a uh, not a tweed but a box. I'm sorry, Fender. <laughs> Anything you want, you can just dial the sucker into this thing, and it's still playing. And tell you what you want, right? So simple. So, uh, again, you push effects, up come your effects, you go up to whichever type you want. The clean effects, there's mainly just, you know, clean sounding effects. Or you turn the dial, and you get distorted effects, right? You start off with the uh, MS, uh, what is that, uh, MS Drive, sorry. Alright, or you can go to, uh, say your Texas. On that and 
then you go to your edit button again. You push edit, right? Oops, push the wrong button. Hold on a minute, guys. Go to edit button, push edit. Uh, same thing. Uh, you can do your compressor or limiter, uh, rack limiter, right? You can go to your FX, right? Ring modulation, slow attack, fixed wah. You can actually get a booster in there to raise up your levels, just like a booster on a pedal booster, okay? Uh, Preamp, same thing. You can just do anything you want to with it. Blues, crunch, uh, you know, anything. Just dial it in and adjust anything you want to adjust. It's all adjustable. The tone, the pitch, uh, the cabinets that you're doing again, uh, tweeds, fenders, stacks, uh, it's a Marshall. Uh, <laughs> sounds like a Marshall and uh, you can change your levels up any way you want fine-tune those right uh, uh, you have a six-band equalizer on every effect that you've got so you can actually really 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 fine-tune that thing from the best bass to low uh, mid to middle to treble the presence uh, harmonics on it uh, anything you want to do you can adjust it through this one single uh, board right uh, it's just amazing uh, what this thing can do. Uh, do a flanger. Change the pitch. Maybe a type effect like a, a voice pipe. <laughs> Pretty neat, huh? Oops, uh, exciter. Everything you possibly think of, uh, you can dial into this board here that I'm pointing at uh, through the effects channel, uh, through the edit channel, and save it uh, for your one effect, your special effect that you say you match 16 different items on this board and put it together to get one special tone that you wanted, that you liked, and save it. You follow me? And give it a name, right? Or you can import effects off your pod or whatever. This little board here for two ninety nine, I don't think you can beat it. Uh, you can you can control this thing from uh, from your own uh, little stand there beside your uh, amp, or your sound guy can do it much better than you can. It frees you up to play and sing, which makes more sense. Um, and you can also record your band as you're playing in stereo. Uh, or if you're doing your own uh, 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 work, you can do your own mastering uh, work on this thing and, and also do your own drum effects on it. Uh, which, I mean, damn. <laughs> what more can somebody want than uh, what this thing can do? Follow me. You actually save this or assign this uh, kit, right? Studio, live, rock, pop, funk, jazz, acoustic, techno. <laughs> you assign it to one of these channels, you follow me? And then it plays back forever, that same whatever. So simple, so simple. So, what more can a board do, right? It gives you like 600 different effects, plus all the fine tuning involved. And then, of course, you go over to your amps, right? Sorry, go to your amp, 
and pick up its dozens of effects. It's crunch, it's uh, uh, treble, it's bass, it's mids, uh, it's special built-ins and all their adjustments. Whoops, come on camera. Blues, uh, class A's, uh, twangs, cleans, insane, metal high gain. Uh, on down the line. I mean, every channel you can think of, you can program it, right? You can also do loops on this that, uh, you know, include uh, crap you've done on your board. So, your mind and what you can do with this, uh, you know, are just not limited, as in a pedal is limited. You follow me? These things can do anything, whereas a pedal, it's going to do that one sound for 69 bucks. Or 29 bucks or 300 bucks this does every one of them and the only thing it doesn't do that well is a wah pedal which I recommend you get you a crybaby wah but after that hell who needs a pedal <laughs> I got every single one of them looking at me right here any questions about this or anything else give me a holler Dave in court in Texas and I sure hope this answers your questions that uh, you had about this and that uh, you can see yeah there's actually over 600 effects you can do with this so far that I've been able to count. Have a good one. Bye.